What is up, YouTube? It's Card RG, and it looks like EA came out with a brand new promo today. It looks like two of them, actually, but this promo seems to be, like, the most interesting that I've seen. I haven't really looked into the promo at all. I just, like, got on my phone. I was like, the promo looks pretty good. I was just reading it. So, we have Play Lyrements, our go-to show, our go-to the store for Pick'em Ballots. Remember, we used to, the last time we had Pick'em Ballots was last year in the playoffs where uh, you could like pick. It's like okay, let's say like the Warriors are playing the Cavs. You say you could pick like if Tristan Thompson gets more rebounds than like Zaza Pachulia, or if LeBron scores more points than Curry or Durant. So yeah, that was what happened last year. That's the last time we had picking ballots. That was pretty good. Okay, so use picking ballots to acquire NBA awards nominees and their specific nomination ballots. One nominee from each award category gives you a chance at the Pick'em Ballot, Pick'em Awards Master. Uh, nomination ballots will become winners or losers based on the results of the NBA Awards on June 25th. Use the six winning nomination ballots to acquire 98 overall Pick'em Shack with In the Pain Ability. So they brought back In the Pain, in the pain Ability with the centers, I guess. I remember the last time, the first time they had. The in the Tate and Billy last year was the Juggernaut Trophy, Juggernaut Shack, like 100 elite trophies for a 90 overall, 91 overall Shack. I'm not sure about that, but yeah. So here's a Shack right here. Car looks pretty good, honestly. But it's kind of weird because they just came out with that DeAndre, 100 overall DeAndre Jordan. Now I'm just like, I was hoping on getting him, but I guess I'm not going to get him anymore. Fuck, pick him up. And we, now we have the. Uh, draft week, which is I think it's the twentieth, but celebrate draft week with nineteen ninety six NBA and classic players. So those are we got some pretty nice NBA players right there. So let's check out the let's check out the store first. So I'm gonna forget to check it out if this promo is actually lit. All right, so. Let's claim our bonus pack before we do anything. Okay, first thing that we notice when we get on the game is that, unless I haven't noticed it yet. What? Okay, it wasn't going to be three like the last promo. Wait, was last promo three? Last promo was one and one. That was the red pack. Never mind. The first thing that I notice is the new pro pack animation right there. I mean, the, pro, the new Pro Pack art right there before it used to be something else. I think I'm going to just, like, put in the thumbnail. But, yeah, we have new Pro Pack art. We just opened one Pro Pack right there. So, in this one, you get a gold player chance at an NBA Awards nominee. Seems free trash with 100 cash. How much is 100 cash worth? 100 cash is worth, like, a dollar. So, if you think that everything else in that pack is worth a dollar, then if you think 10 ballots in the gold player is worth a dollar, then yeah. But yeah, let's also open this with some rep. So we got these pick-up packs here. Let's see what we're going to get from them. So we ended up pulling, okay, five pick-up ballots. Okay, but like, I think that we all know, or we all have an idea of who's going to win them. Most of the awards. I think that. Whoa. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna be back. But yeah. All right. So I could feed those five minutes right there. There were like five minutes left. If you saw them. But yeah, yeah, they're like five minutes left. First live into the awards. Let's see what we're getting. I also saw '93 LeBron James. That live event was like kind of. It was different than all the other live events that we've had this season. It was probably like the hardest run live event where you just like run from one side of the court and just dunk it or something but yeah so let's check out the sets what is, what is this for a chance i can be draft player all right so they're probably not gonna come out with the nba draft players until whoa okay so let's go through all of these all right so mvp nominees i think that we all know that James Harden is going to be the MVP. 
but I don't I don't know why I'm putting all the ballots in here. But I just gave him all the ballots. But the defensive player of the year is the one I'm not too sure about, honestly. Because Joel and me didn't play that much games. Neither did Rudy Gobert. So that's that one is actually kind of confusing. Huh. And then, of course, rookie of the year, ballot. Well, it'll probably be Ben Simmons. That's what people are saying. I mean, I wanted to be Don Mitchell, but like, then again, Don Mitchell beat the Thunder in the playoffs. So, like, I'm like, you know, we'll just give it to Ben Simmons. I don't care anymore. Six man of the year, of course, it's going to be Lou Williams. He averaged like 20 plus points. Pretty sure he averaged over 20 points. Coach of the year. Did they already gave Coach of the year? No, that was like, the coaches at the coaches voted. I'm guessing coach of the year is going to be Brad Stevens. At least I think so. I'm not sure about the coach of the year either. But was this most improved player nominees? It'll be Old Depot definitely. I'm not sure if that actually matters what I'm saying because I thought that. And then we have this Shaq right here. Let's check him out. All six winning platinum nominees. Okay, so it looks like oh, this is going to be hard because like if you miss out on like, so I'm not sure what the defensive player of the year is or the uh, what is it, the coach of the year is. So I'm pretty sure it's not going to be Dwayne Casey simply because he got fired, so we can take him out right now. Quinn Snyder, why would he win coach? Quinn Snyder, let's see, what did he do that was worthy of winning Coach of the Year? The Jazz were in the playoffs. They were doing good without Gordon Hayward, and Rudy Gobert was out for a long time. He was like out for like 30-plus games. And then Brad Stevens, he was, I mean, I would say it would be Brad Stevens. That's my vote, at least. I'm going to go ahead and go with Brad Stevens. And I'm guessing that at the end that these Players will turn to platinum if you get them right. Let me check the news out again. So, one nominee. Yeah, one nominee. Right, right. Chance at pick them on board. Okay, I think that it, as long as like you cry me a bit, maybe you get two chances at some of them, but like defensive player of the year and coach of the year, even though I'm pretty sure it'll be Brad Stevens and uh I'm not sure who the next player of the year is, honestly. But let's go over here to where's the draft at? I don't understand where they put it. They have a new pack right here, too. A new Russell Westbrook pack. See? But, yeah. Where's the drive promo at? What's going on? What they do? Can we have a well, outside of 93 overall shooting guard, Magic Johnson, for the classic lineup? It's pretty interesting. But where is the drive promo? Oh, yeah, we didn't even check out the shot stats. Only 90 and 92 rebounding for, like, one of the most dominant centers of all time. This dunking better be, like, it dunking should be, like, a 99, honestly, or a 100. I know it's a 98, but 94 and type main shot, okay, okay. Everything makes sense. Maybe his blocks would be a little higher. It's actually a pretty good card. But, what is this? So, apparently, there are also elite players, which you turn in for a platinum player. I saw one of the elite players in the live that I play. It was like a. Maybe. Those elite players were from this. I'm not. This promo is actually kind of confusing. How long could this last six days and eight hours? 
Okay, so this promo is actually kind of confusing. It actually looks kind of just saying, but it's actually confusing. So I'm guessing that none of your pick and ballots matter. Yeah, they don't matter. So I just said all that for no reason. And then you just turn in elite players from the pick and ballots for a platinum. You just have to turn in one from each of them, and then you'll be fine. You'll be able to get the shack. So yeah, that's apparently how you complete the promo. Everything I said was wrong. Because with the LeBron James, you also get the... Hold on. Yeah, it's not saying which team, so. Or is it? I'm, I don't know. Maybe you have to get him right? I think you have to get him right in order to get the Shaq. But let me know what you guys think because it's just question right there because it's not saying it's in the one, but it could also be saying the one that's right. I haven't gotten one yet. So I'm going to come back to you guys on that, but that's going to be the video. If you didn't enjoy, be sure to leave a like. Peace out.